I think we're going through a major shift and it's a very exciting shift and it's a shift away from the enterprise being focused as it has been traditionally for the past 100, 200 years on being producer efficient, cost minimization, maximum efficiency towards a completely new model which is uh, away from producer efficient supply chain to the customer effective demand network and this is what I mean but when I say that if you don't transact with me in the way that I want, when I want and how I want, with what I want, I will switch to your competitor. And we see so many examples of this in terms of customers moving to self-service in airlines, in music, in photography, um, and we will see it in financial services. We have the technology to allow people to specify and buy online uh, the car, the automotive with the, the wheels they want, with the color they want, with the specification they want. We just haven't enabled the customer to do that. As a result, we build so many cars to forecast. We get the forecast wrong. They don't sell. We have to sell them at a discount. It's a broken model. We have to move to build to order because that means we don't have to worry about getting the forecast wrong. And then we try and forecast customer behavior. We, have, we will get that wrong too. We have to, if we try and forecast the brand experience, we have to allow the customers to create their own value and engage when and how they want as they choose. And the, the brands which get there first will be the ones which retain the most customers and build the most value. But for many senior managers, they will choose a cost minimization strategy over a value maximization strategy because we know how to manage cost, define cost, we can take cost out. And therefore, personally, we're going to be much more successful adopting a cost minimization strategy than adopting a value maximization strategy.